Hey, happy Thursday to everybody. So, we're getting a lot of questions uh, from referral partners and from other clients about the 2 1 buy down and how we're using that to get people off the fence. So, essentially, the 2 1 buy down is the same thing as you normally would get with getting seller concessions. All we do is allocate what goes where um, in those seller concessions. So, let's say you have 5% seller concessions. Uh, so the, the, the first part of this, I'm going to show you what it, why it makes sense for buyers and I'm going to show you why it makes sense for sellers. So let's say you get 5% seller concessions, just as an example. We would take about 2 to 2.5% two of that and allocate that to the 2 one buy down. So let's say going rates are 6 and a quarter for an example, okay? Um, your first year would be 4 and a quarter interest rate, second year it would be 5 and a quarter, and then third year it would be 6 and a quarter. So it makes sense if the seller is paying for that, okay? Now, if it goes into, let's say, what's happening right now is that rates are starting to come down. So as they come down, um, let's say all indicators are points about 5% as far as the interest rates. So let's say you get to around 5%, but you're at four and a quarter. Around that time, it might be a good time to refinance and basically lock in that rate. Even though you're at four and a quarter right now, you, you know next year it's gonna be five and a quarter. So it makes a lot of sense for the buyer to, to look at this program. And, and the two and a half percent, that's a little bit high as far, I always, I always give a round number on that. Once, it's based on the loan amount, okay? So it's still gonna be cheaper to two and a half percent than based on the sales price, okay? So we allocate that part for that, and then the rest of the seller concession gets applied to closing costs, prepaids, and everything else, just like you normally would. Now, the advantage to the seller is, because I'm starting to see this happen a lot more, a price reduction, so forth, it's not really that exciting um, to buyers, because when they see that, they're, they're, they're probably gonna be like, okay, well, it's probably gonna reduce again, so I'll wait for the next time. But if you put it in there and say, hey, seller is willing to do uh, two one buy down, where you can lock in a much lower interest rate, that does a couple of things for the seller. It helps them market the property differently than everybody else. Number two, it's a lot cheaper to go with the 2-1 buy down for them than to reduce the price, let's say $10,000. Okay, so it's an advantage to the seller, it's an advantage to the buyer, and the third thing is we've been showing clients cost of waiting. Hey, if you wait now, it's gonna cost you you know, $5,000 over the next six months. Then it's gonna cost you almost 12,000 and then so forth. So there's- In one mile. Use the right lane Sorry. to take exit one uh, US 11 W West Stone Drive. I'm heading to teacher's class left. right now. Actually about a two on buy down. So anyway, hopefully that makes sense. If you got any questions on that, please comment down below, shoot me a private message or text us at our office number 423-251-8083. Talk to you soon, bye.